Hello everybody, my name is Lachara, and this is Man Games Talking to another episode of my Let's Play. Currently working on Cyber Shooters, which is my first third-person shooter, I believe. It is a spin-off of the um, Cyber IP, so it's a fairly valuable IP. Got Kung Fu Kicker, which is a fighting game. It's an exclusive for my console. It's not selling very well. It's probably going to lose a ton of money. Wave Racer 2 looks like it's selling pretty well. Should should end up being profitable. We got Ninth Fantasy, which was my triple-A game, my first and only at this point triple-A game. It's actually making money. The Great War. <laughs> this was a console exclusive for all three of my consoles. It is not going to make money. It's going to lose like eight million, eight and a half million dollars. Uh, my consoles are selling very well right now. The Lachera Pocket is up over 10 million in sales, which is great. Market share is only 7.2%. Thanks, Game Boy. Um, yeah, so let's work on this game. Um, my American team's not doing anything right now. Let's actually train them. They're to the point where they're caught up and they can get through what they need to do very quickly. Well, let's, uh, let's train them up so they're even better at their job. Uh, secondary development team is not doing anything right now, so they could do a free update. Or, Uncle Kicker's already had one. Oh, what about the crazy games? This is an add-on. Yeah, it's profitable. Let's do another update. It's a little cheaper doing updates for that too. All right, customer support queue is down to nothing, so let's cancel that. And let's do a couple of fan campaigns. Let's do a couple of games conventions. Get some extra fans rolling in. I mean, I have over 2 million fans. Getting 2,000 extra fans isn't a lot, but we'll do it a few times. Console team has got nothing to do. Research is currently working on fans for the tech level 5 console, stationary console. We still don't have our tech level 4 handheld because the screen isn't out yet. As soon as that becomes available, we'll do that. I want to do another update for Ninth Fantasy. There's already been four, so it's probably pretty expensive. Yeah, six and a half million? No, I don't think so. Wave Racer 2, though, it's only had two updates. It's selling fairly well. Yeah, let's do an update for that. Yeah, 2.4 million. That's a little better. A little more reasonable, right? All right, so everybody's busy working on cyber shooters. No idea if this is going to be good. Like I said, it's my first ever third person shooter game. Well, not ever. In first one in this run, right? So my people don't know how to make them. I don't know how to make them. The sliders were definitely in the wrong spots, right? So, yeah. Anyway, should be fine. Yeah, Kung Fu Kicker is going to lose some money. Not as much as the Great War loss, though. But, I mean, I did move 155,000 of my consoles. Isn't bad, I guess. Yeah, that was not great. Oh, I forgot to do this automatically. Marketing support. Oh, and start automation. Thank you. There we go. All right, so what kind of game are we going to make next? What's hot right now? How long is this the trend for? 75 weeks. That's a long time. <laughs> um, we just did a fighting game. We're doing a third-person shooter right now. Ooh, survival is popular and unsaturated. This is eco-sim, but we've done an eco-sim far more recently than a survival game. Of course, I'm pretty sure I'm also more experienced survival games well i'll just i'll update both those engines get them both update up to date ready to go yeah this one hasn't been updated in a while <laughs> clearly it's still tech level three there's been a lot of tech level four stuff come down since then and that's fine yeah i can't remember what, uh, how valuable is my ip that i use for survival games not very i don't think no research, okay. Any commission work over here? There is. Give them something to do. They don't even need training anymore. They're like full. Right. And that's fine. That's not a bad thing. All right. So they're polishing, they're polishing. They're on the last thing. They're bug fixing. Okay. So let's uh, bring the marketing team back and do a pre release for the press and a beta demo. Since it's at 90 hype, not 100, but. I'm not spending $500,000 to get 10 hype. It'll be less than 10 hype once you do the beta demo. Definitely not going to overhype this, though, because I don't expect it to be anywhere near good enough to be worthy of 
overhype. Um, so what could go for a demo demo right now? Blue kicker could. Let's do that. That was really quick. <laughs> um, cyber shooters, no. We'll put a demo for that out later. What about my consoles? How are they doing for hype? Um, 81. Yeah, let's throw them back in training for now. Because we don't need to do any marketing at the moment, I don't feel. All right, so let's also update our eco engine, which I'm pretty sure has been updated more recently. Yes, it does have some tech level four stuff. Not the newest, well, it has the newest sound, I guess. It has definitely been updated way more recently than the survival engine was. All right, so we are bug free. Did I do, wait, did I do both things? Yes, okay, I did. Just making sure. All right, so what's the development report say here? 70 to 90, that's actually better than I expected for my first ever third person shooter. If it's 85 or better, I'll be I'll be thrilled, honestly. <laughs> do I wanna polish it a little more? Polish it to the end of the week? Sure, there we go. All right, so I own three um, publishers now. None of them specialize in third-person shooters, though. So we'll just go micro arts. Yeah, my first third-person shooter. Not pros at any of the um, engine things. Well, I guess sound we're good at, but yeah. So yeah, I'll be thrilled if this is eighty-five percent, and it should sell okay. Eighty-eight, nice, because it's the only third-person shooter on the market, right? Which is nice. So we definitely want a game report for that. And for the fighting game, because we're not good at fighting games. And uh, I think Wizard World is my IP for survival games. It's only 0.4, but hey, it's a start, right? So Wizard World 4. We're going to go AAA. I'm going AAA here. We'll see. I might regret that. A very real chance I regret that. Survival, multi platform, we'll go PC, we'll go Mac, go with Share Cube 2. It's out there for dev kits. Nothing that's internet capable. Sorry, Nintendo 63. Ziggy Uranus, sure. I hate that it makes it, it's complex, so it makes it take longer to make the game. Kind of hate that, but. Yeah, it is what it is. All right, everything looks good here. At least we're not, you know, completely rookie at any of this stuff. Copy protection. Boom. All right, so. A few of these are in the right place. Is this in the right place? Or is that a holdover from when we didn't have mocap? 30, 30, 10, 30. It is a holdover. 30, 30, 10, 30. And let's take a look at the letters here. Um, too short, more innovation. Too short, more innovation. So, I don't know where character design is supposed to be. It's not supposed to be there. <laughs> uh, we'll leave it there for now. Yeah, yeah, sure. Turn on everything. Yeah, 46, 50. Yeah, definitely AAA. I'm not cutting six features, right? I'm just, it's not happening. So no wheel support, no replay function, and no light gun support. Other than those, everything goes into this. All right, and obviously we're going to put everything we have into this. It's going to be expensive. And you know what? We can cheap out on the sound. The sound's not important. Right? Everything else is, though. Yeah, they're working on the game reports. Just have to keep an eye on them. All right. Uh, blast through this commission work here. Wow. $12,000. Yay. <laughs> That's really going to make or break me. Um, yeah. All right. Take it off. Pause. Watch the QA team here. And immediately get them to do their thing 
Yes, Cyber Shooters is selling extremely well. Holy crap. That is great news. Oh, that's AAA. Kind of forgot that that was AAA. That was risky. That was very risky making that a AAA game. I think it'll get its money back based off those sales. Should. Ninth Fantasy ended up making, well, it's at $23 million and still rising. Right? So, all is well there. We got hardware. We got 32 megabyte memory card. All right. Come on back, research team. All right. And let's... Do we want to move the marketing team back yet? Wait a bit. All right. So that update is done. Sales have dipped. Right. But they're still solid. Uh, anything else worthy of an update? Maybe Wave Race? Wave Racer? Much, how expensive would this be? Oh, only 2.7 million because it's only double A, right? That's a lot more to do triple A updates. And once this gets to about 50%, we'll move the uh, marketing team back and do the marketing for it. All right, so yeah, sales spike back up. That's because of the update. Um, actually, we should put a demo out for this as well. So yeah, let's move marketing team back now. Do a demo for that. And then we'll do some TV spots. Wizard World. No, no, not Wizard World. Uh, Cyber Shooters. Demo. Let's see if we can get up this up to 100 height. And then let's mark it. Wizard World 4. Get that to 100 height. See how much good this demo does. There we go. 99 height. Beautiful. It should help sales a little bit. All right, so what are we doing here? Yeah, we can go do commission work again. Probably do an eco sim next. And okay, so advertising team's gonna have to work a little harder. <laughs> Junku Kicker's actually not too bad. It's doing much better than World at War or whatever. I forget what the, I forget the name of that one that lost me a ton of money. I've kind of erased it from my brain. All right, so Mad Games Convention. Um, let's get Kung Fu Kicker some hype. Let's get Wizards World 4 some hype. Let's get Wave Racer 2. No, Wizards World 4 doesn't need it. Uh, yeah, let's do that. And, of course, both consoles just in time. So I was about to have to do advertising for those. We got new hardware. Yeah, the Tech Level 5 hardware is starting to come through. And I still don't even have my Tech Level. Oh, there's a whole bunch of stuff here. Modern 3D voxel graphics. Of course, I was almost 5 star in a graphic feature so of course new graphics have to come out that's the rule right <laughs> that's what we need to do here eventually we we'll need to do special marketing but i don't want to do it just yet i think the next trend is going to be interactive movie is that accurate yep yeah, okay and building games are going to be unpopular that is fine 25 percent of players have access to the internet now so that number's creeping up. All right, so they're polishing, they're polishing. Of course, I only I did one less feature for them. So yeah, I'm gonna need a bigger graphic studio soon because they're behind. They still have, they gotta get through 33% of this and then a whole other feature. Whereas like, they're already done. Again, they're done, but I didn't do all the features. Yeah, they're behind. Uh, mod support, ooh, be spicy. Um, yeah, let's do another Cyber Shooters update. I don't know how many I'm going to do total, but we can do one more. Ninth Fantasy sales are starting to lag. It'll be off the market soon, but hey, my first AAA game was a success, I would say. Fair Pocket still kind of chugging along. 11 million copies sold, or not copies, units, I guess would be the word, right, for that. All right, so we might as well throw them back in training for a couple minutes. And we'll move them back when it's time to do the pre-release special marketing. I might overhype this. We'll see how it looks when we get a little closer. Yeah, I want to say my last, my last run, my last let's play. I think I could be wrong. I'm pretty sure though that I had my Tech Level Five stationary console out before. 
my tackle before handheld. Pretty sure. I could be wrong. We're still a few features away from that, but we'll see what happens. All right, so I'm making an eco sim next, right? And I've already done that engine, although it is now out of date. So I, <laughs> I guess I do need to update it for the new graphics, although not the graphics really matter for uh, an eco sim, but might as well have the best stuff, right? Any commission work here? Nope. All right. Oh, even more. Uh, let's let's end automation. I want to get that other feature. All right. So let's do pre-release special marketing because it's getting close. Pre-release for the press. Do a uh, uh, seventy to ninety. Mm -hmm. I wish that said eighty to one hundred. I don't think. I don't think I'm gonna overhype this. Online leaderboards. You can add those in probably as well. I mean, this is the good thing about doing AAA, right? I have room to add these features as they come through. And let's go back to bug fixing since we're creating new bugs. And once this is done, we'll see if it's up to 80 to 100. It is not. So we're not over. I'm not overhyping it. I'm just, no. <laughs> not worth it. I don't think anyway. Um, what do we got going on here? Might as well just do some commission work. And then we're gonna do an eco sim, right? Was the plan? Cartridge is cartridge for handheld is coming through. How close are we here? Okay, so we still need a processor, still need main memory, still need a graphics chip. Yeah, so we're we're not that close. But we have everything else, but I think we need, yeah, we need the case and the controller as well. So yeah, it'll be a bit. It'll be a bit. Um, is there any reason to hold this back for polishing or anything? I don't think so. I mean, 70 to 90 is fine. I'm sure it'll be 85 plus, which is, you know, the goal, right? Yeah, we're getting better stuff. Yeah, almost got up to five stars in graphics. <laughs> Before the next one came through, but I didn't quite manage. 88%, that's fine. Considering how unsaturated and popular the genre is, should be good. Let's just check. Eco Sim, yep, still popular, still unsaturated. Yeah, Survival's a little more saturated now. Uh, yeah, there's eight Survival games. But there's 13 Adventure games. So I guess that wasn't the ooh, 11 strategy games. I do need to make another Satisfact Oreo at some point. Because it was like, it's my most successful game. Profit wise, at least. So Crazy Games Tycoon 6. That's my P value now. Two stars, right? This will probably be double A. Because not many features. Heck, I could probably potentially make this size A. Because Ecosim just. Features just don't apply to eco sims, right? Like, all right, so that one goes there, and that one goes there, and that one goes there. <laughs> 2640. So I can make this size A. <laughs> We're going to go double A. Um, but what about the internet capability stuff? Or any of the internet required ones? They are okay, so we do want to make sure all the consoles are internet capable. That's why I didn't do, I didn't have the consoles yet. That's why, because I wanted to check on that. So PC, Mac, Share Cube. I want to skip the Stiggy Uranus because of this complexity. I don't know. It's ten million extra people. Nine and a half million extra people. I think we're going to do it like this. Yeah, so we're pros at the sound, almost pros at the AI, getting better with the physics, and once again, fresh graphics to learn. Okay, so these should be good. <laughs> you should be locked in. Man, there's a lot of extremes with eco sims. No wonder my first few eco sims were garbage, right? Plus, all the features that don't apply. 
Modern controller support. Okay, boom, good. High quality graphics, high quality sounds. And again, I could probably cut some of the graphics and sounds because they're just not important to that genre. But, yeah. Gameplay, okay. And while we have our marketing team here, we might as well market it now. Right? They're already here. Perfect. They're doing... What's my call? Okay. So they're working on game convention. Let's end automation. I don't want to forget that. Like last time that I set them to do that, I forgot. And like the queue for support got pretty big <laughs> while they were doing that. So I'm not going to do that this time. Going to remember. All right. Okay, this uh, add-on for Crazy Games Tycoon 5 was made 5 million. Perfect. Bunch of old, crappy old consoles off the market. Nothing that really matters. Okay, so new CPU coming in. Wizard World 4 is selling fairly well. Um, so we want to do an update for it. Is there how many updates I'm going to do for it? Hey, it's actually continuing to climb, which is nice. Ninth Fantasy officially off the market, $29 million. Thrilled with that. All right, so this, it was at 100 and it lost because of the event. I don't think, yeah, we'll just do a demo to get it up over 90. We can overhype as well, or try overhyping. Um, does anything need a demo? Yeah, Wizards World, let's throw a demo at it. Sales, sales have started to drop on it pretty hard, actually. Cyber shooters still vastly exceeding my expectations. <laughs> if I'm being honest, it's already had a demo though, right? Yes. How are my consoles for hype right now? 84 and 90. Now let's get the pocket back up to 100. They were like the same before. Why are they so different now? I wonder. That's weird. All right, so the holiday season's about to hit, which will be good for sales, obviously. All right, so research team has nothing to research. Although I'm pretty sure there will be more uh, console stuff soon. All right, so what are we gonna make next? Do I wanna make strategy game, even though it's like the most saturated? RPG's popular, it's saturated. I haven't made a Three Kingdoms game in a long time. I think I need to make another RPG. Uh, so let's update the RPG engine. Do all the best stuff. Yeah, it had been a minute since this was updated, clearly. All right. Yay, I won some awards. I won all the awards. No, I didn't win game of the year. Damn you, Civilization. Yeah, me to hell. Oh, sure enough, there's the... <laughs> Look at all the hardware stuff. Oh, there's the case. Oh, case for handheld. We're not waiting for the case. We're waiting for the screen. So, yeah. We're going to be close to be able to make Tech Level 5 console here. Really close. Uh, yeah, sure. While well, we got them here, we might as well get that maxed out. It's right, so Rule 4 sales went back up uh, because of the update, because of the demo, now because of the holiday season. It's got a ways to go before it ends up being profitable, but it's it's trending in the right direction, right? <laughs> All right, so special marketing for War. Crazy Game Second Overhype. I might regret that, but I'm doing it. <laughs> and it didn't go through, so it doesn't matter. And... Uh, Demo and pre -release, pre release suppress and a demo while we're here. Hopefully, it ends up being good. 97 hype, that is better than fine. A little training for them. 80 to 100. Hey, turns out those sliders are very important for this type of game. All right, so let's, uh, let's polish a little bit here. Nothing too serious. RPG next, right, is the plan. Ooh. Ooh. I just had a thought. Potentially wild and crazy thought. 
do I want this RPG to be an MMO? Let me know in the comments. Should I make this an MMO? Not this. <laughs> the the Three Kingdoms game that I'm about to make. Uh, uh micro arts, sure. Because it's it's quite a bit more expensive, obviously. Ninety five percent. Holy crap! That's maze balls. How much more expensive is it? And it takes quite a little longer. Twenty eight million. So it's an extra twenty eight million. I'm pretty sure we'll get our money back, right? Obviously, it'd be a sequel. It is a fairly valuable IP, if I remember correctly. Uh, four and a half, yeah, four and a half out of five stars. Obviously, it would be AAA. Three Kingdoms Online. I don't know. What do you think, folks? Let me know in the comments. If you enjoyed the video, Hit that like button, subscribe if you haven't already. Check out my main channel. Check out my Discord. Link's in the description down below. There's also a link to my Patreon there. I greatly appreciate all the support people give me. Keeps me going. So shout out to my patrons. Most importantly though, folks, be good to each other. Have a great day. And I'll see you in the next one. Where I will possibly make an MMO.